Welcome to the University of Michigan Dentistry Podcast Series, promoting oral health care worldwide. Faith, it's great to see you again. Has anything changed with your health? Um, no, not really. No new medication? No. no changes in old ones? No. Okay, well then we'll go ahead and get started with today's crown. Um, crown, you mean filling? I hope. <laughs> what, what were you expecting to have happen today? Okay, I thought we had talked about me getting the metal taken away. The composite would be, would be more flesh colored, and that my concern was the cosmetic look of this. Okay. It's so apparent when I laugh and smile broadly. It's a lot of metal. I understand what so, you're saying. I think we're talking about the same tooth, the one on the mm -hmm. bottom right. Right. Okay, but you were expecting to see a filling done on it, not a right. crown. Right, right. Get okay. it all tooth colored. Yeah. We're not on the same page. <laughs> but we are we are okay. on the on the goal there. I was expecting us to go to a tooth colored crown on the tooth. Okay. That would have it all be tooth colored rather than the filling material. Okay. I thought that we had talked about that, but um, maybe I misunderstood, but I thought that it was a or I've heard that you can have them replaced pretty easily. A lot of people do it. I don't remember if that came up in our okay. discussions in the past of treatment options for this tooth. Uh -huh. Um because you you're absolutely right. Tooth colored filling materials uh -huh. can be used to replace the silver ones to give that good aesthetic right. look. Right, and that's what I want. Right. And, and I completely understand that. The problem is that there's limitations to where you can use the tooth colored oh. ma filling materials and where, where you can't. Okay. And some of what it comes down to is the size and the area. And on, on a back tooth there, mm -hmm. where you've kind of already got a big filling in there, so then yeah. the, the tooth colored fillings, you know, got to be the same size. It's yes. going to be big as well. That's a lot of stress for that filling material to try to bear. Oh, okay. um, and it, it can go wrong in two different ways. We could have too much wear on that filling material and it okay. doesn't hold up, or the tooth structure around it might not be left solid enough. Okay. That, that you almost, or potentially could fracture off part of the tooth structure. Then we're leaving ourselves in kind of an unknown situation. If it fractures too low, we could have to extract the tooth. If it fractures higher, we could be talking about root canals or just crowning mm -hmm. the tooth. Mm -hmm. So are you telling me that the first option of just having it replaced is not a possibility with the, um, the composite material? I, mean, I can't just switch it out? I don't think that it would be a wise decision so for us to make. I okay. think it would put, put that tooth at a lot okay. of risk for future okay. trouble, especially because the tooth doesn't have any cavities right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. The filling you have is holding up fine. Mm -hmm. But I understand that you know you're looking in the mirror and saying I don't like the way right, this looks. Right. Right. Okay. So if that's not an option, is the only other thing I can do to get rid of all the metal look is to get it capped? Is that like my only real option? That's. Those are pretty yeah. much the only two options okay. that I would feel comfortable doing. Uh, okay. You know, could we put the material in there physically? Yes, the tooth color filling mm -hmm. material. Mm -hmm. But to to have it be a wise investment mm -hmm. of your money and give mm -hmm. you a good long-term prognosis, right. Right? right? So we want this to look good, but to last right. and keep the tooth Obviously. healthy. Yeah. I think that we're talking about either sticking with what mm -hmm. we have and losing the, the looks mm -hmm. of it, mm -hmm. or doing a tooth-colored crown okay. to, to kind of keep the tooth strong, but also change mm -hmm. the outside to all be in tooth-colored porcelain. Well, it's not the way I wanted this to go. <laughs> I was looking at it more of a simple switching it out. I know that the cost is going to be a lot more, isn't it? Yeah, it's we're talking be. like five to ten times okay. the difference, probably closer <laughs> okay. to five times. But yeah, I mean, it's a and, significant okay. factor. And then how many appointments? Or this is going to be a long... Yeah, so it's not going to be... I couldn't get you your final crown today like I could if it was a filling. By Christmas? Mm -hmm. it, it would just take us, if, if the first we do the first appointment here today, mm -hmm. what we do is we prepare the tooth for a crown, and then take a really good impression of that so the lab can make a crown that fits your okay. exact tooth as I prepare okay. it. And then it takes them about two weeks to make a final crown that mm -hmm, we could go ahead mm -hmm. and cement on there. So yeah, it is, as long as things went as planned and we could get it prepared, get a good impression, mm -hmm. yeah, I would I would say we'll have it in there by Christmas, barring anything that right. would come but up. Right, but I'd have a meantime. temporary, that would be Yeah, so in the meantime, I just make you a temporary, okay. be it's not going to look quite as good as the mm -hmm, final, mm -hmm. but, you know, hopefully it would pass the grocery store test, someone right, would come up right, and see it, they'd right. never notice. Okay, well, it's kind of far back, yeah. I mean, it's a little way back. Um, I think I would still like to go ahead with this because it really does bother me. It's like uh, my nephew, you know, kids always just tell you how it is. It's like, well, you laugh, and I just see all this metal in your mouth. And I'm just thinking, I'd like to, you know, tone that down a little bit. I thought it'd be more simple, less expensive than what we're talking about. But I feel confident in you and, and the 
McDonald's school, and if you think that that's the best decision, I'm gonna I'm gonna trust you okay. and go with it. I'll probably need a payment plan, but and we can set something up where maybe <laughs> okay. you pay for enough to cover the yeah. labs costs yeah. at the start, and okay. then you pay the Let, rest in a it. couple of increments. I feel I want to do it. So. Okay, that okay. sounds good. You've been listening to a production of the University of Michigan School of Dentistry. For more information about Michigan Dentistry, visit us on the web at www.dent.umich.edu.